uh, today, April 11th, 2019, uh, a pre pretty big event happened. Uh, the last image came back from the Israeli spacecraft before it failed crashing into the moon. Now, before I show you that picture, I want to show you the source where it came from because that's important for validity of the image. You can see here, uh, this is the Twitter feed of Elad Ratson. He's a diplomat, envoy of the State of Israel, director of the R&D unit for code and data diplomacy at the Israel uh, Ministry for Foreign Affairs. So this guy's legit, blue check mark, all that good stuff. You can see he's been tweeting stuff here about uh, the spacecraft all day. Here's the image in question. Just received from Space IL communication team what appears to be the last image of the bear sheet. Uh, spacecraft managed to beam to Earth before it crashed on the moon's surface. So there you can see the image. Now if you click this off his Twitter feed you can download the image. If you download it you get this right here. It's the same thing uh, I just have it inside of uh, the Windows uh, image viewer so that you can expand. Now the first thing to note when you're looking at an image from space like this is to figure out the orientation of things in space. Where's the sun? Well the sun pretty obviously is off to the right over here. You can see the lighter glare coming. If you look down at the craters, you can see that on every crater, the uh, whitest and brightest part is on the side facing to the right. The uh, shadows here are all casting uh, leftward, and it's pretty easy to see the sun is over here in this region where you see the cursor going. So this image is kind of, kind of strange. Uh, you know, first uh, thing, people would look at it and just think that that's all a bunch of light refractions, but uh, that, that can't be it. <laughs> it's, it's rather strange because first off, you have two different colors here. Uh, these are kind of yellowish up around here, which will be a little more clear here in a moment when I expand it. And then these are purplish, uh, which is rather strange. I don't know, maybe there was some kind of gas floating in space being lit up from uh, sunlight, perhaps, but there hasn't been any explanation or clarification that I found about this. What I found exceptionally strange, though, is this right up here. What the heck is that? Now, if you zoom in, you can see right away here that uh, this definitely appears way more solid than everything else. This right here is definitely in the background. There's two refractions in front. Those are ghost-like images. Those are definitely refractions. But the image behind is solid. And not only that, it has banding. It looks like the clouds of Jupiter. Anybody that's looking at that, if you don't tell them when or where this is, and if they can't see the lunar surface, the first thing they're going to say, oh, that's a picture of Jupiter. That's the first thing my 12-year-old son said when I showed him, before I showed him the rest of the picture. Hey, Dad, what's that picture of Jupiter? That's exactly what it looks like. You can notice that there's an image refraction up here, right there, one here, one there. Little images here, 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 up there, over here, over here. At different layers you can see the images a little better. So it appears, the sun being here, that this is a solid object. And all of these yellowed ones are reflections of light off the cloud surface of that. That's why it's a different color than this down here. The, there's no lens flare. If there was a lens flare from the sun, which is sitting right about here, it would be coming directly across there. That's not what you see. Uh, you do see a large afterimage right there, 
but uh, now another thing to see which you can really tell when you zoom in to right about here keep in mind the Sun is over here this side is light this side is dark again that looks like that is a real solid object the left side is darker than the right side take a look down at the craters on the craters the uh, this side is lighter this side is darker every one of these craters everything is consistent with the Sun being in this position that being a solid object what is that there isn't supposed to be anything that close to the other side of the moon it's definitely not Jupiter even if Jupiter was caught in the image it would be so far away from this little satellite it would look like a dot it would not look like that that's not Venus that's not Mercury none of those would look that large from this camera uh, the other odd thing is if you take a look at the stuff that's lit in purple maybe that could be um, the exhaust from the engines perhaps that's why that's that shade because it seems to be an expanding gas you kind of have a uh, purplish gaseous haze all the way through there um, but if you really look in there uh, and if you've ever seen cometary jets or gas escaping this right here that has like a tripod type looking shape uh, you know like there's maybe gas jets and it kind of comes out there's a bit of an artifact there and there like it might be gas coming out from something but this particular shape right around it isn't even circular this outer one is which you know that is probably actually an image refraction of whatever is causing the light right there um, but that actually looks like it's something solid impacting moving through a light gas layer over here you notice uh, two light circles here and then two darker ones here and what almost looks like a nucleus there kind of like a cellular nucleus but that's definitely not what that is but um I think those two are refractions of those two there and that those are actually real the bright area is real again that could be lit gas a little piece of something coming off the satellite maybe again you can kind of see a purple there 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 that's kind of looking flat and impacted that could be a refraction of this brighter one right there that I believe is real perhaps it could be a uh, you know hitting some some kind of electromagnetic uh, force and then you got this right there there's really no explanation for how you have that right there I'd like to see an analysis of that from somewhere um, the craters all look normal as you would expect although I did notice one thing right here there seems to be a little rectangular object right there can't really tell what the heck that is it doesn't look like there's uh, like that's just image artifact of any kind because you don't see any kind of pixelization or squarification of anything else in the image it's only that one little area right there by that crater uh, you know I'm curious as to what that is but the thing most of all is this now I know right away everybody's gonna say Nibiru Nibiru uh, I can't say no I can't say that that's what it is but I could say that's the closest looking picture I've seen out of every claim made on YouTube or the internet of something that actually could possibly be that that looks like that that appears to be a real solid object uh, you know cuz that image seems to be casting that shade that shade that is though 
that is solid and all the rest of those lighter yellow areas are refracted images. What is it? I don't know for sure. I'm not going to sit here and claim like the way some of these uh, you know, uh, famous channels on YouTube do that they know what it is. God only knows, but I would like to see uh, some more analysis of this from you know, the Israeli Space Agency, NASA, uh, you know, prove whether that's real or not. Explain what that is other than claiming it's an image refraction because it's not. Hope you guys find this as interesting as I did. <clears throat> you can check out this fellow's Twitter feed, Elad Ratson. If you want to go there and download the image yourself, I have it saved on my PC. You could always direct message me if you want to get a copy, if you can't get it through any other source. Um, one other thing I found really odd is uh, when you click on this and you look at all the comments, <laughs> nobody says anything about that. It looks just like Jupiter. And in all these comments, not one person asked about that. Hey, Elad, what is that? I'm sure somebody would have noticed and would have asked the same question I did. It was the first thing I saw. I find that extremely strange that out of uh, all these comments, not a single soul asked, and there's 108 comments, out of 108 people, <clears throat> nobody asked the first thing that I saw that looked off with that image? I mean, somebody deleting comments? That's rather odd. Anyways, I uh, hope you guys enjoy this. Um, you know, leave comments uh, if you like. Have a great day.